What's going on guys? Out here for a solo mission today. Hopefully we can get into some fish and I hope you guys enjoy. Yo! There's something on here. Pulling pretty hard man. Don't want to lose it because I haven't got anything all day, anything decent. Just let it go, if it wants to run, just let it run. Oh, it's a good snapper. Yes! Are you kidding me? <laughs> nice winter snap. Nice winter snap. Shit, yes. 59, 60. You want to get him right there. There's a soft spot behind the eye. Put him there, twist, and when he kicks like that, you know that you've got him. I also like to cut the gills. It makes it taste less fishy and better to eat in my opinion. There it is. Oh, it makes it all worth it when you get a nice eating fish like that. Also, sound is playing up. That's me, sound a switch. Oh, she's a cold one this morning, mate. Oh yeah. Out here early this morning, mate. She's pretty, she's pretty chilly, but into it anyway. I think I've got a snapper on here. I've also got that other line. Just trying not to lose it. Yeah, yeah, it's a snapper. Yes. Yeah. Yes, bro. Beautiful. starts kicking you know that you've got them and then I just cut the gills because it gets the blood out makes it taste nicer and you can see that he's going pale straight away so yeah I've got them we were just sitting down chilling and something came along and smashed my jig bent my rod almost in half. I had to grab it real quick. Thought it was gonna snap it. That was hectic, man. This must be a big fish. Big snap. Big old snap, man. Big snap. Oh, that just came along and Oh 
hang here. Eh? Yeah. We'll give it, give it a hold up. Yeah. That was cool. Oh, well done. How was that, man? Far up. Yes. <laughs> Had mass tangles, so I'm gonna gonna redo this here. It's gonna start with a sinker, mate. 100 pound leader, bit of a uni knot, right quick. It's gonna go through four times. Two, three. Uh, that'll do. Three will do. I lied. It was a lie. Pull that up nice and snug, mate. And uh, we don't want to be on the too much on the ground because that's where the sharks linger so I'm just gonna do a loop put in the mouth five times two three four five back through to try to drop a loop back in the mouth slowly pull it too then we're gonna put on our little bit of lumo tube to give it a bit of uh, visibility down there in the depths, right? And we're gonna put on our recurve hook through the front, front of the eye. Right, got it through, and then we're just gonna put it back over the hook. Good to go. Just put our swivel on, and then we'll be back down there fishing. 10 ounce, one hook, black magic swivel, black magic 100 pound, recurve size 5 Motsu, and I've got a pink Lomo tube, mate. We were just chilling out, and Snapper have come on the chew. Drift anchor popped off and had to save it, and managed to hook it on the, on the jig. And uh, that other rod bent over and all the shenanigans. Try aim on that one. Well done. Yeah, boy. It's dinner, mate. Mint. Actually, mint. Back for another drift. Brian's line was going straight under the boat, but it doesn't matter, does it? Clearly, clearly, it doesn't matter. I don't know what we've got. Oh, no. Oh. It might not be a shark. Fingers crossed. Snapper, bro. Yes. Yes. Such a nice one, bro. Stoked as. Well done. That's easily legal. It's my hand. Might release it. <laughs> 